Hi, I'm Greg Padgett, and I'm the team member at Small Sugar and Il Focolare. Business definitely took a hit um, once COVID started, but we've done a great job of uh, finding ways around COVID and somehow still giving back to the community, which is one of our main things that we pride ourselves on. One of the biggest changes with me, I was a team service member, so, you know, right now with the protocols, we aren't doing any dine-in. I've taken on more of the role of just being that helping hand around our establishments. Sometimes you'll see me here at Small Sugar. Sometimes you'll see me over at our pizza place, Il Focolare, helping out. I think my biggest personal challenge has been, I've been trying to basically stay in and be safe and precautions and everything I'm doing because I know how detrimental I am to this business when I'm here. And our staff is kind of underhanded right now. We're short staffed, so I don't want to put myself in jeopardy and then they're down and another person, you know? So I think the biggest challenge that we've dealt with so far is just absolutely trying to maintain and stay afloat. I think we just have to find a way to get creative. We like to make it feel like a family bond here and that we know everybody, we know everybody by name and stuff. So, you know, it's kind of hard to still do those things when people aren't able to dine in. With COVID things happening, I didn't think our restaurant was gonna last, you know, I, I was very scared. But our team here has done a great job. Our bosses have done a great job of establishing us, still giving us our full-time hours, never cutting back on our hours and finding other ways to make profit for this business. We knew that a lot of kids were gonna be out of school and parents weren't able to work. So we thought we could maybe lighten up the burden on them just a little bit and making dinner for them every night. You know, so we put together well over, I wanna say 10,000 family meals and gave them to the, um, underprivileged areas throughout the community. And 100%, I feel positive. I, I love everything that I've seen about this. We're all about giving to our guests and giving back to the community that we're in. I mean, we love Columbia, we love the Midlands. I would go out and tell people, it's like, take time and effort to invest in yourself and just like enjoy what you're doing, embrace this moment and be creative. I think if you didn't come away with something creative in this, it's, it's kind of sad in my opinion, but I think that's something that not only from a personal standpoint, but a business standpoint, everyone, I think COVID made you become innovative in a way.